Hey, do you feel like you're suddenly seeing a lot more Target inventory flood places like Goodwill? Well, you're not wrong. And I'm going to tell you why. I'm Refashioned Hippie and I'm a full-time mom and a full-time reseller. And I absolutely love what I do. And I love sharing information with people who are just starting out. So Target has always gotten rid of their old inventory by trying to get as much money out of it as possible. So they do things like donate it to certain places so that they can get a tax write-off. A lot of times they will sell their unsold inventory to places like Goodwill, um, to restore locations, um, sometimes to Second Avenue or Salvation Army. No, it was a mess. Okay, so they've always done that. But recently, Target has had just a lot more inventory than they can handle. Basically, they've been betting that the market is going to stay the same or in some cases increase. And for things like clothing and other technically unnecessary items, they've been wrong. So Target, Walmart, a lot of big stores like that have a lot of excess inventory that they suddenly have to get rid of because the second Christmas is over, ugly Christmas sweaters are not only worthless to them, they end up costing money because it costs money to have employees pull them from the shelves, to have them store them, to have them shipped somewhere. So they suddenly need to get rid of a lot of this inventory very, very quickly. And they want to do it at a profit. So what does this mean to you as a reseller? One, that you're probably going to see a lot more new with tags Target clothing showing up in the thrift stores that you like to go to. And two, that means that the market itself is going to be flooded with that inventory. So I'm not telling you to not buy it because it can still be very profitable for you, even if a lot of other sellers have similar items or even the same items. But I am going to tell you to hedge your bets a little bit, um, especially newbies. Don't just buy something because it has a new tag on it. That's like buying something just because it came from anthropology. That doesn't mean it's going to sell. It could still be ugly, right? Um, what I will tell you is that there is a really good market for those pieces. A, a, something like Target, Massimo Supply Co. You know, people are very familiar with that brand. This might actually be a Massimo Supply Co. Um, people who have been shopping at Target for a really long time know how the brands fit them. They know that like a Mossimo Supply Co. medium is going to fit my body this way. So that means that buying it from you might be a little bit easier, even though you are a stranger on the internet, because it's still a brand they're very familiar with and it's got a new tag on it. But you're going to want to hedge your bets and not just buy everything. So personally, I only buy things that I know will sell. For me, that includes swimwear. Um, my mother-in-law actually works at a restore great resource. If you can get a family member who works at a thrift store, do it. Um, but she's able to buy a lot of inventory at really, really low prices. Their store ends up being so flooded with all of this Target stuff that they literally just put bins of clothing out on the floor because they don't really sell clothing. That's not what they specialize in. So you can buy all of this new with tag inventory, usually for a dollar. They have dollar days where you can just get every single piece for a dollar. I love buying swimwear because new swimwear can be expensive. And especially smaller size people who don't have these gigantor boobs love just wearing it and having bikinis to change into all the time because they don't have gigantic boob problems. So what I do is I buy a lot of that inventory for a dollar or even 75 cents if my mother-in-law is willing to help me, which... Thanks, Sally. Um, and then I'm able to sell it at still technically low prices. I usually sell like new swimwear tops or bottoms at only about eight to $10 each, but I get a lot of really, really quick flips. Um, so that is my advice when it comes to the new Target stuff, but you are seeing a lot more of it because Target has to get rid of more and more stuff. So just hedge your bets. Good luck out there.